Transport Cabinet Secretary Kipchumba Murkomen has claimed that there is a close similarity between President William Ruto's manifesto and ODM leader Raila Odinga had. While defending the continuous housing levy in Homa Bay, Murkomen said the former Prime Minister had also planned to implement housing fund had he won the presidential poll. Murkomen jokingly claimed that Ruto picked the idea of housing from the Azmiola Mojawan Kenya Coalition Party's manifesto. According to Murkomen, Raila would have also introduced a 3% deduction on salaried Kenyans towards the housing fund. At the very same time, the cabinet secretary called on leaders from both political divides to find common ground on the contentious proposals in the Finance Bill 2023. In a related development, the government will wait until January 2024 to start deducting the housing fund from employees. The National Assembly Finance Committee proposed several amendments to the Finance Bill 2023. Should the proposals be adopted by Parliament, the housing fund will be reduced from the current proposal of 3% to 1.5%. The committee, led by Molo Member of Parliament Kimani Kuria, also recommended that the monthly deductions be subjected to employees only. The bill has faced too much scrutiny from the general public as high cost of living continues to rise, burdening Kenyans, making hard for some people to put food on their table.